With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Students, the question is: In which quadrant do the following points lie? The point is minus four comma minus six. Okay, so the given point is what it is minus four comma minus six. Now let us see this that we are given x negative, and we are given y also as negative. Now, if I see the Cartesian plane, okay, so here this is the x-axis positive, and this is the positive y-axis. This is the negative x-axis, and this is the negative y-axis. Okay, so what we can say is we are having four quadrants here. This is the first quadrant. This is the second quadrant. This is known as the third quadrant, and this is known as the fourth quadrant. In first quadrant, x is also positive, and y is also positive, and in the Second quadrant, we are having x as negative and y as positive, and in the third quadrant, we are having both negative. Okay, so x also negative and y also negative, and in the fourth quadrant, we are having x positive. Okay, so x is what positive, and y we are having here negative. Now, if we see, we are given what we are given negative comma negative, and we can see negative comma negative. This lies in which quadrant? It lies in the third quadrant. So. The given point that is minus four comma minus six will lie in which quadrant? In the third quadrant. Okay, it lies in the third quadrant. So this is the required answer. Okay, it lies in the third quadrant. Thank you. For class six to twelve, ITG and NEET level, trusted by more than five crore students. Download Doubt and App today.